Hello friends and neighbors, boys and girls, welcome to another edition of the Old Doe Bros. I am Drew. And I am Christian. And now it is time for our week in review. Great week we had last week, didn't we? Uh, came right out of the New Year celebrations and straight into Epiphany. We had the chalking of the doors uh, to, to remember that God blesses our, our going out and our coming in always. And uh, it, was a, it was a great week, Christian. How, how was your week? I had a good week. Came back from vacation and started back up with youth group, which was awesome. And don't forget to take the survey that I've been sending out in the emails so that we can get your feedback on what's been going on in youth group. Feedback is so helpful. And it is. surveys with the survey monkey. It's mm -hmm. great these days. It's a great tool. Let's go ahead and uh, do our look ahead. Uh, what do we got coming up, Christian? Well, the big thing for the two of us and all of you is we have the ski trip coming up. And there's been about 14 of you that have signed up so far. Uh, but there's still a chance to, if you'd like to go, make sure that you sign up by either emailing myself or Drew, mm -hmm. um, because we're trying to reserve our equipment in the next couple days, and we want you to have equipment so you can ski. Um, and also, the Bible study will start up next next week, Wednesday, uh, Wednesday night at five or not five. Worships at six, okay. dinners at six thirty, and then the study will be from seven to eight in Father Bob's office. Um, and then the next awesome. big thing is Youth Sunday is coming up. Don't miss um, it. On February 17th, I'll be coming around this Sunday, this Sunday, with a sign-up sheet to your Sunday school classes um, to get people to acolyte and also to be readers, and we also need someone to preach as well. So be on the lookout for that, as well it's as a lot of fun. Mm -hmm, as well as signing up for Winter Jam, which is that afternoon. Winter Jam. So keep an eye out for that. How about you, Drew? Well, um, we've got this new thing called the ODEC Bible Challenge 2013. This is the best opportunity, the, the, just the golden opportunity to read the Bible in, a, in 365 days. That's one year. Read That's the entire possible. Bible. It is possible. It's a big undertaking, but it will bless you, and we're going to do it as a church together. Uh, so be on the lookout for sign-up sheets, for more information, for bookmarks. When you sign up, you get a t-shirt, you get lots of support. There will be adult forums to, 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 to talk about the scripture we've been covering. Uh, Wednesday night series, we'll, we'll touch on reading the Bible as well. And uh, we're also going to have a blog site uh, go up that's going to be able to be a forum for people to post their thoughts, reflections, ideas, and just have an, a conversation online. And we'll have people there uh, to engage you. On, on that level as well. It's going to be great. And that's going to start the first day of Lent, which is Ash Wednesday. It's a Lent to Lent Bible challenge. So uh, keep your eyes out for that. Plus, coming up, we've got a Gospels class that's going to be taught on Sunday mornings. So over 10 weeks, come learn uh, about these amazing, rich texts. Speaking of Bibles... Right? I hear yeah. you have a Bible fun fact for us. You know, it's funny you mentioned that because I do have a Bible fun fact, and this Bible fun fact comes to you uh, from, from the Gospels. This coming Sunday is the baptism of our Lord. That's what we celebrate uh, the Sunday after the Epiphany. Uh, and so we will be here uh, discussing, uh, preaching, celebrating, and remembering uh, that the Holy Spirit comes down at baptism. That is the Bible fun fact, a little bit more of a liturgical fun fact, but uh, that does it for another edition of the Old Doe Bros. I am Drew. And I am Christian. And we will see you next week. See you next week. Bye-bye. <laughs>